they are pretty identical as you may see very slim there you go one is by apple and one is by satechi that sounds premium it's just the difference in color isn't it so i have been thinking for some time if there's any other wireless keyboard that is way similar to the apple magic keyboard too small slender and good experience up until i came across this guy hello everybody welcome back to my channel if you're new to this channel this is a platform that i use to share my opinions and experiences in relation to video audio and gear that might be helpful to you so today we're looking at the satechi slim x1 a very interesting wireless keyboard that is way better than the apple magic keyboard 2 in my opinion They're almost the same size, same design. It's just a difference in color. So Apple, Apple discontinued manufacturing the space gray color. And this Satechi Slim X1 stands out because it has the space gray color. And I think this is going to be a huge selling factor for the Apple, for the Satechi Slim X1. I did a video a while ago about the substitute to this guy and today i thought maybe i could get the same original slim x1 and let you know about my experience using it so one of the things that really stands out uh, with this wireless keyboard is the fact that this is space gray and um apple magic keyboard 2 only has this uh white color silver and white at the moment as i speak um due to the fact that they discontinued the space gray version um from a filmmaker's perspective i like less bright colors or rather from my in my opinion i really prefer less bright colors and this satechi slim x1 comes in handy when it comes to you know that dull color if you like dull colors and you already own um apple magic mouse too that is space gray this will match up perfectly to be honest from a video editor's perspective i don't really care about the typing bit but it's just about portability and how small it fits on the table they connect really quickly to your machine when you switch it on um they could both go wireless or you could use the cable that comes along with it the keyboard design is very close the keyboard design is specifically designed for macintosh or apple machine users um, you could still use it on your windows but to be honest for the best experience is when you're using it with a macintosh or apple products um just a few things that make the slim x1 stand out from the apple magic keyboard 2 um, and one of which is the fact that you can control more than one device at the same time um, it has like three options on the keys where you could switch in between either your ipad or your imac or your mac mini um, one other thing that makes this stand out is mm, the fact that it's backlit uh, means if you're in a darker room or rather at night somewhere working you can still be able to see your keyboard in low light which is huge and it kind of reminds me of the video that I did a while ago about the slim x1 substitute you should check it out check out the video um, because that keyboard was also backlit uh, the only difference between this and that other keyboard is that that other keyboard changes colors uh, in the sense of being backlit and the slim x1 does not change any colors it just stays in that white regular glow that's the only difference between the slim x1 and the apple magic keyboard too um pretty much rest of the stuff is the same connects quickly um feels good feels premium um and pretty much that's it um yeah and to be honest if you want to know my opinion i'll take this over this guy that's why i'm gonna sell the apple magic keyboard too 
and keep the Satechi Slim X1. I'm not being paid by Satechi, but it's just my humble opinion about the things that I use and I think probably that will be helpful to you. So, sorry to interrupt the video, but after using this Satechi Slim X1 for a few days, I realized a few flaws or a few downsides that it has uh, from the typing perspective. So I am just gonna do a demonstration right here. Something is wrong with the keyboard where it doubles up on the letters. And yeah, I'm just gonna type. I don't have the best grammar, but you're gonna be the judge on how this thing performs. Okay, let's jump right in. Um, real quick. Ah, at the, see, it doubles up on the E. I typed the E once at the time of this video. EO. I have gotten to realize that the slim, okay, that's my own table, realize that the, the typos on this keyboard, keyboard, are way too many see the o's i only typed two o's and made three it doubles up on most of these letters i just don't know why i don't know if it's a design flaw or you know those doubles drive me crazy that's why i'm going to return this puppy it's beautiful but <laughs> it's space gray matches up with my table my most of my computers my monitors but <laughs> no it's not the best in the initial see the double e video that i did that i did i was really impressed by the design see there is doubled up again of the slim x1 anyway i think that's just enough for you to get what i mean um i really love the design the whole look of you know um but i might have to go back to the magic keyboard 2 uh which is almost the same size and everything but because this guy i'm gonna have to return it um i just thought i would bring that out and kind of take back all my words that I say in the video and the design the other stuff great but typing when it comes to editing I don't really care because it's not too much typing in editing but when it comes to typing like you're a typer mm, 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 not good all right back to the video or if you find this video helpful please like the video share the video and subscribe to the channel support the channel and I'll see you in the next video